Hello, my name is Mark, welcome to my review channel. Today we're going to take a look at the Studio Regent headphones. The Studio Regent headphones are available in black or white. I've got the black version to test. I think they've got a pretty good style about them. You get the headphones themselves, but there's no case included. They do fold down though, so if you are traveling, you can fold these down, pack them away, but there's no protective case bundled with them. They've got quite a nice style to them. The black ones have the little gold trim and they extend either side. Nice padding around the top. And I've got to say, these are a very comfortable set of headphones. The gold extends around the side, so you've got a simple black plastic with a gold line. If that's not doing it for you, you can replace those plates. These are available as additional purchases. And the idea is that you simply rotate this off and you'll eventually be able to pop the new one on. I had great difficulty getting these off. I actually had to contact the manufacturer to see if I was doing something really stupid. They said, no, just give it another go and a bit of a tug and eventually you will get it free. And they were correct. I did eventually manage to get these off and I was able to replace the original plate, which we've got here with this nice new one, kind of a marble effect. I've not seen this sort of system before. It's an interesting way of personalizing your headphones. It is a little bit tricky to do, but once they're in, they are in, and you can just replace one if you want or replace both. It's up to you. Headphones are pretty comfortable. They sit on your ears and take a bit to get them shifted in, but otherwise they sit very comfortably over my ears. They've got little controls on the side for turning it on and uh, forwards backwards play. They've also got the charging port and a 3.5 jack. Next up, I've got audio recorded directly from the headphones. At the time of review, these were priced uh, around £80 from the manufacturer's website. And I have to say I was a bit disappointed with the sound quality for that. I found it to be quite flat. It really lacked any bass. And I think you've got quite a lot of competition at this price range. Certainly at the lower price range, you can get headphones that have a bit more oomph to them. But if you are someone who really likes their bass, really wants it thumping in your ears, these are not going to be for you. If you want to learn more, I will put a link in the description below. If you found this short review useful, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.